going on guys my name is moose 78 and it has been just a little bit since i uploaded my last video here to uh youtube there eh about a year or so ago to be exact and uh some of you guys probably might have saw uh my little teaser video i did about a week or so ago saying soon so uh, we'll address that today we'll address where i've been what happened all that good stuff i know some of you guys have been asking hey where'd you go have, are you still gonna upload videos you haven't uploaded for a while is everything okay and everything's great i mean it's it's nothing dramatic it's nothing juicy uh the fact of the matter is i just got burnt out on doing content i was doing you know five uploads a week then i was doing three streams a week over on uh, twitch tv and i just burnt myself out you know i i got to a point where i felt like i had to create content that i had to do it and everything and that was never my intention you know because it started to feel like a job and of course you guys know about a year or so ago I started a new job and that was one reason for stepping away because I didn't know where all that all this was going to fit into that so that was a part of it but that was a very small part of it I'd say that was maybe about 10 to 15 percent of it if we want to put numbers on it for whatever random reason but the biggest thing was I just burnt myself out I like I said, it started to feel like a job, like I had to do it, and that was never my intention. I always wanted this to be a hobby, to be fun, and I just kind of just got just, I don't want to say bored doing it, but I felt like I wasn't being as creative as I could be. You know, I started to upload just clips, or not really clips, but, you know, 30, 40 minute videos of streams, because it was easy. I didn't feel like I had to sit down and think of something to do or you know things like that you know the stories from the road let's play even got a little bit just kind of mundane for me and that's never a place you want to be as a content creator you want to be feel like you know you're passionate about it you're excited about it like you just can't wait to sit down in front of the computer and make something and i was so far away from that place i just stepped away wasn't sure if i was going to come back to it or not but as you guys saw, you know, a couple weeks ago, I uploaded that little teaser saying soon because I have here recently had the itch to get back into doing content creation. And we'll talk about that. Well, we'll just talk about it now about uh, what that's going to look like moving forward and kind of what I thought in you know, my head was, you know, one, maybe two videos a week and just see where it goes from there. There's not going to be no hard upload schedule like, hey, every Monday, Wednesday, Tuesday, Thursday, whatever. It's not always going to be me sitting down doing a Let's Play, you know, my stories from the road series. It'll make a comeback. Don't worry. It, it will make a comeback. But it could be, you know, two, three weeks where I just upload gameplay videos. I honestly don't know. In my mind, there are some exciting things to talk about within ATS. You know, you got the Oregon DLC coming out. Very excited for that. Uh, I played. I have played the game a little bit over the last year. Not a lot, honestly. Not a lot. I mean, I don't even have all of New Mexico explored yet. I've not been to all the cities, so that just kind of gives you an idea of where I've been with uh, American Truck Simulator. And to be honest, I've not done a tremendous amount of gaming over the last year. I've, you know, played some of the Division here and there. I've hardly touched Battlefield One in the last year. Um, been playing quite a bit of Madden on the uh, Xbox, but uh, that's about it, to be honest. But like I said, I do think there are some good things coming for ATS. The Oregon DLC, I think, is going to be great. Uh, the New Mexico DLC, I thought, was far and away the best map they've done for the game since its release. Looks great, plays great. It just feels unique from the rest of the game, which is what you want when you're creating all these states. You know, I know it's because of played them so much but you know california nevada arizona you know they just don't feel unique enough in their own regards i mean they have some spots here and there that kind of do but to me new mexico just feels it stands out as far as being unique from the other three states and i think oregon's gonna be the same way too so i'm really excited for that and the other thing i'm really excited for with uh, the oregon dlc will be the implementation of trailer ownership. Praise Lord Gaben, we're finally getting trailer ownership in American Truck Simulator. Now, I'll probably talk about this in another video because I kind of want to get a news update video, kind of. Now, I know a lot of the news obviously has been out there for some time, but just kind of recapping everything and looking forward to, you know, what we might see um, 
an ATS in the coming year, or whatever. Just, you know, something along those lines. I don't know. But uh, one thing I have been working on kind of in my downtime, I guess, if you want to call it that, at least in the last couple months, is really sitting down and starting to learn Blender. I know I talked about it, you know, a year or so ago. Hey, I want to sit down and learn Blender. I would sit down, open it up, kind of look at it and go, okay, this is hard. I don't want to do this anymore. And, you know, didn't, didn't touch it. But uh, big shout out to uh, Jeff over at half Ass Gaming. How you doing, by the way, Jeff? He does an amazing job on Blender tutorials. I will link his channel down below. If you are wanting to get into modding and you want a free resource, which Blender and Blender tools from SES are free, not like Zmod where you have to pay either a monthly or yearly subscription, check out that channel. Again, link will be down below. Half Fast Gaming, phenomenal tutorials on how to use Blender. Very detailed. Just cannot say enough about the quality of the tutorials uh, they do over there. But uh, I've been learning Blender. I've got about four models right now that I'm trying to get in game. Uh, got them all off of 5150. I'm sure you guys are familiar with his work. You know, if you've been around the community for any length of time. And uh, the first one I'm working on, because it's complete, is uh, the 1993 Kenworth W900 flat glass. This thing is detailed like no other. Looks great, looks amazing. Can't wait to get that finished, get that in game. It will be a private mod, as is everything else that I'm working on, unfortunately. Maybe I'll talk about that another day in another video, but not now. But uh, working on the flat glass, also working on a trailer for a uh, trailer ownership. I got a uh, spread axle utility reefer off him that I'll be working to get in game as well. But uh, tons of stuff I want to do for the W9. Maybe I'll make a video about that. If that's something you guys are, would be interested in to watch me mod, trust me, I wouldn't do try to do tutorials on how to use Blender because I am literally still very much in the early learning stages of that. But, uh, you know, just sitting down, watching me mod, talking about the plans that I have uh, for the model and uh, all that. So we'll try to quickly recap here. I know I've been rambling on for a few minutes, but uh, I'm trying to ease my way back into the content creation. One, two videos a week. Not always going to be stories on the road. It might just be gameplay videos. Uh, Want to sprinkle in some news videos like I did before because I enjoy doing those, and I think you guys enjoy them as well. They always seem to perform pretty well. One thing I got into a little bit, not a whole lot, just because I'm not a big fan of doing it myself, and that's the mod reviews. If there's something out there, you know that I like and feel like doing a mod review on. I might do that, but honestly, if you look at all the ATS, you know, the ATS community on YouTube, the mod reviews are fairly saturated, so I'll probably kind of shy away from that as I have in the past. But yeah, that is pretty much it for today, guys. I think this video is going to end up being like 8, 10 minutes of me just sitting here talking about God, I don't even know what I talked about at this point, to be honest. So uh, apologize for that, guys. Apologize for kind of rambling on. But yeah, that's going to pretty much wrap it up for today, guys. I know I rambled on for probably close to 10 minutes about uh, where I've been, what I've been doing, what I want to do. Just be, you know, keep an eye on the channel. And uh, like I said, hopefully get back into the groove of things here. Get a couple videos out a week. See where it goes. And uh, get to the part where uh, I think you guys are familiar with this. If you like today's video, just give it a like and a share. Helps me on a bunch. Helps this channel grow. Just helps it get more exposure. Helps with the YouTube algorithm. All that all that hot nonsense but uh, until the next time guys stay safe out there take care and we'll be seeing you